I've been working on this tool called Cryptocurrency GPT that's supposed to be your own personal cryptocurrency assistant. It can buy cryptocurrencies on your behalf, it can look up the price of cryptocurrencies, it can help you understand the fundamentals of what makes that project interesting, uh, and it can also plot data for you. Let's start by asking what is the current price of Ethereum? What is the current price of ETH? So this is actually real data. You know how ChatGPT can sometimes hallucinate information and just outright lie to you and kind of make stuff up if it doesn't know what the answer is. This is actually real life information about the Ethereum price as it is right now. So the cool thing about it is that this is connected to my Binance account using the Binance API. So it's aware of my Binance activity, right? So for instance, I can say, what are my last trades on Binance? And sure enough, it's using the Binance API and is returning the last few trades that I've done on Binance. So you can see the trade ID, you can see the symbol, you can see the order type, you can see the status and the quantity. Let's ask it how much ETH or how much USDT I've got in my account. How much USDT do I have in my account? Okay, so we have a little bit of USDT. We can place one trade or two. Another cool thing that you can do with it is that you can actually ask it to buy you cryptocurrency straight from here. As long as it's connected to your Binance account, you should be able to just buy crypto straight through your, your cryptocurrency GPT assistant. Let's ask it to buy us $20 of Bitcoin. So you can see that my USDT balance is now $8. So, which means that it placed an order of approximately $20 and it bought me uh, $20 worth of Bitcoin. So let's uh, ask how much Bitcoin we're currently holding. How much Bitcoin are we currently holding? So we're currently holding 0.0007 Bitcoin, which is just a little bit over $20 of Bitcoin, which again confirms that it had placed the order. You can also go to your Binance order history and double check this if you like. Okay, so finally, the last cool thing that this tool can do is that it can plot data in real time. So you can ask it to plot you a Bitcoin chart and it'll do that. So here we go. We've asked it to plot us a chart for the last 30 five minute Bitcoin candles. So each candle represents a five minute interval. Um, and uh, and here's a chart. It comes straight from TradingView. It interacts with the TradingView API and it gives you real time chart information. You can ask it um, based on this kind of format. You can ask it to plot you any kind of uh, any kind of data. So you can uh, ask it for, let's say, uh, Polkadot. Polkadot candles. And instead of five minutes, we're gonna do 15 minute. And instead of last 30 candles, we're gonna do last uh, 50 candles API. And sure enough, this is the Polkadot um, chart with the last 50 candles on a 15 minute interval. Let's try one more. Let's do Dodge. Uh, let's see if we can get it to plot us the last 100 candles on a 30 minute interval. Which is going to clear the history again and run. Oh, and you can also look up information that it's not aware of. So it's connected to uh, Brave Browser. So if you're asking, if you ask it a question about any cryptocurrency or, or anything at all, if it doesn't know that information, it will look. Um, you will look for it on the web and then try and return a relevant response. So yeah, that's about it for this video, guys.